son of Charm City, who made his own way with music. All right, everybody. Dante Winslow. Yes. Composer, producer, yes. trumpeter. Yes. Now, I want to do something fun. Okay. Can you walk through all of your career highlights in one answer on camera? Let's try. <laughs> Let's see. Good luck. Yeah, thank you. I moved to L.A. I began working with Queen Latifah, Jay-Z, Dr. Dre. I was the conductor, orchestrator, composer, and performer for the 2022 Oscars. So I have films under my belt, conducting, scoring, playing, touring. Ah, tours. That reminds me. He is performing with his buddy Justin Timberlake, but we'll get back to that. Now, for all my Baltimore people thinking, well, how do we know he's really from here? I started at Cross Country Elementary. I went to Falstaff Middle, School for the Arts, High School, Peabody. Yeah, from here, from here. So coming back here is always special, taking him back to where it all began. The goosebumps I get from this music, I want to be able to experience that with other people. And the trumpet for me was the instrument that I think God used, like Moses with a staff to part the Red Sea. I used the trumpet to just cut through all of the negativity I experienced growing up in the city. Early on in his life, the images he saw of Baltimore were dark. Living on North Avenue and seeing the struggle, seeing the drugs. But between music, faith, and the right mentors, that picture started to look a lot brighter. I've seen so much hell and pain, and then God flipped it and showed me glory and love and blessings. Which brings us back to, you know, being on tour with the guy many call an R&B and pop superstar. To us, he's Justin Timberlake. To Dante, he's a friend. And even on stage, if you pay close enough attention, you can tell. It's a point where in the middle of the song, I'm singing the words, and I love the, this part, particular bridge hook. And me and him come together, and I go, right before he goes under the stage, we fist bump and we salute each other, and we have this bonding moment. And then there's Justin just casually at their family cookout a day before the show. No big deal. So, of course, Justin has to be his favorite person to perform with, right? Nope, not even close. His wife, Mashika. The top thing is always going to be me and Mashika Winslow Dynasty. We have our own album. That's the best project you're going to ever get. Why? Well, there's the chemistry that goes back to their days at the Baltimore School for the Arts. We're talking about a husband and a wife duo. We know that's the most magical thing in the world. We have an amazing, blessed marriage, and our music together is love on stage. So when it's not his wife, JT, not a bad option. What you should know about Dante, if you're meeting him for the first time, when he's not composing and scoring or orchestrating or playing. I want you to know that I'm just like you. Like, I'm the kid also that was walking through the streets with his horn, that had to catch three buses to school, that went to work three jobs while he was in college. I walked and escaped the killers and the drug dealers. My friends all did that. That's why this visit is about more than putting on a great show at CFG Arena. Guess what? It's still work to be done. There's still work to be done in our community and for our children. We have to pour into the kids now. Hollywood is cool. This big show is cool. But the real work is humanity. And what better way to send that message than with a sweet melody? Randall Newsom, WMAR2 News.